Since you should know about n factorial, besides the usual definition, let's start with the approximation first. n factorial is approximately square root of 2 pi n, and we multiply by n over e and raised to the n's power. And this right here is good when n is big enough, so we just say this right here is for large n. And this right here actually has a name, it's actually by the person Sterling, so this is called the Sterling's approximation. Okay, next let's talk about n factorial as a derivative. This is just going to be dn, meaning that we are going to differentiate n times of what? Well, of course, x to the nth power can try this out. You will actually get n factorial, all right? And of course, after the derivative, let's talk about integral. n factorial is the same as the integral going from 0 to infinity, t to the nth power, and we multiply by e to the negative t dt. And this right here is actually what we call the gamma function at n plus 1. And perhaps this is like the king of all, all right? Okay, and of course, this is just a small bonus because this integral is equivalent to the integral going from 0 to 1, and then inside here we have negative ln t and raised to the nth power here, dt. Alright, you can verify this on your own by doing some use substitution. And the fun part is that right here you can do a lot of crazy things. For example, you can do the pi's derivative, right? You can seriously do the pi's derivative if you like, of x to the pi's power like this. You know what we'll get? Of course, pi factorial, alright? How do we calculate pi factorial? Yes, we are going to use this right here. So, crazy, huh?